my name is Kate Wilkinson. I am a hair artist. I've been doing hair for 14 years and I love it. And I am just going to be showing you today um, how I'm curling my hair. Right now I'm wearing hair extensions. Um, as you can see, my hair is this short and put the hair extensions in and I am loving my long hair now. But I get to do all these fun things with it, styling it and curling it. And so I'm just going to walk you through how I curl it. Um, so with this first one, I took away from my face and I didn't show you that one, but I'm going to show you the rest and on the other side. And so with this, I'm going to go towards my face with this next section and I leave that little tail out and I just work my way up towards the scalp and I kind of feel it when it feels warm enough and then I release it um, this is a baby bliss <coughs> sorry curling iron and it is a one inch barrel and so when I release I release slowly and pull and I still want to leave that tail so there you go I'm going to be showing you what I'm going to do afterwards that helps because um, they're not going to stay in ringlets like this, but I let them cool so that they um, get the shape of this, get the shape of the curl. So again, away from my face and I'm just going to be rotating between going forward, front, back so that it doesn't end up in like one big curl on my head which is a look, it's just not what I'm going for. <laughs> yeah. It's kind of hard curling my hair um, on camera. It's not the same as a mirror. And then I just pull. I'll just show you really quickly on this side. So see my shorter hairs here? I have to tuck those behind and then you don't see them once you curl your hair and even if you wear it straight. And so with this one, I'm gonna be kind of pulling forward as I'm curling it. And you wanna keep the barrel going straight up. That's what gives you this loose beachy wave curl. So I just touch it. And once I can feel that it's heated up the hair, I release it. So I'm going to finish up curling the rest of my hair and then I'll come back and show you what products I use to style it. Alright, so this is with it all curled. Um, I am going to be taking my fingers and just breaking that up. So you could leave it like this if you wanted and just touch up some of these pieces. Um, where you want it to go up higher, the curl pattern, like take out even smaller sections and just kind of follow it up and release it. So you could do that like on random pieces all throughout if you wanted to. And just run it over like that. So I'm gonna finish up on the other side and I'll be right back. All right, so this is with it smoothed out um, and the curl tamed down. And I just, I'm gonna show you really quickly what I do with my bangs to help them blend better into my extensions and the curl that's going on. So yeah, you can see that that is like my shortest point there. Kind of bend the hair going into the hair extensions. <clears throat> Sorry, I'm a little snuffly today, sniffly, whatever. <laughs> um, allergies. It's that time of year. Okay, so this is it done. And then I'm gonna be using Redkin's, um, this is like their sea salt spray. 
This one's called Fashion Waves Texturizing Spray. And so I'll spray this in there just to give it some more texture and it helps it calm down a little bit more. And then I take, um, this is by Amika, and this is their, um, it's like a textured spray. It's like a matte finish hairspray. And so I just use that to fluff it up a little bit. I like to use their dry shampoo as well just it smells good and I like the way it makes my hair feel after I've styled it so there you go there's the finished styled look so if you guys have any questions any more questions for me or um, if you come in to get your hair styled by me and colored and hair extensions um, you can just ask me any questions you have about how to style it for when you're at home. Thanks for watching.